I guess this is the fight. Captain Crackhead is out of control. Better call security before someone gets hurt. Why can't you call security? That was... <laughs> Why do I have to do it? <laughs> Why am I in charge of security? Anyway, let's do this. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> when did reading comic books become a contact sport? There's nothing worse than a geek with a grudge. Oh man, look at these clowns. Put the heroes and the villains in separate rooms before you start treating them. What? This is why they're putting this the same treatment room. I have too many backup in the waiting room. To prevent fights, keep them in separate rooms. Are, are you serious? <laughs> Are you, are you, are you, I'm sorry, why, is Elvis like a, like a, like some sort of favourite super character? Alright, let's, um, there aren't many patients, so let's take this time to go up and prevent five fights, but at least I can't be fired, that's pretty interesting. Alright. Uh, let's let's spend some of these experience points. All right, so I think I want to put my general. I think I want to get everything up to level four, just in general. Yeah. I think I want to get everything up to level four for just in general, and then the next next one I'm going to do is toxicology up to eight. I'm going to get that maximized as soon as possible. I don't know why. But, uh, yeah, not exactly betraying comic book enthusiasts in the greatest way possible. Yeah, I... <laughs> A guy who thinks he's some sort of future trooper is wandering our halls. This ER isn't year 3000 boot camp. So could you find him and give him the boot? Are you... When did I become Dr. Pat's go-to guy? I mean... <laughs> <laughs> Why am I? Why, why, I'm pretty sure I was hired as a doctor, not security guard, detective. Capture Space Marine. Oh my gosh, this is just. This isn't. Can you help me? Can someone help me find, find the Master Chief? Where is he? Halo Six. Where is he? Well, I dated this, but no, I, I got an idea. Oh, what was this? Halo 8? See, see, now there has to be at least a few more Halo games before this video becomes dated. I'm... That was pretty clever. Okay, so now I'm wandering the halls. My energy is down. I'm probably hungry, to be honest. Too hungry to sleep, probably. And apparently this guy is... Around here somewhere. Probably stuck in a wall. No, in this game. Ugh. And I have to make sure that I have to keep heroes and villains separated. Even though you can't really tell which ones are heroes and which ones are villains. I mean, what are these guys? Henchmen? I have to keep henchmen separated? I don't know where this guy is. I only got like two minutes to go. Maybe I should go to the security office. Just go to the security office and uh, check the cameras, I suppose. Uh, I mean, I could inform security. I mean, Pratt. I mean, I'm gonna have to call security anyway. Yet Pratt sees fit that I have to do it. It's like we there's a danger here. We need security, but I want you to do it. We've got three guys here, and not one of them. Guys. Oh. Uh, I can't find them. Oh well, I'm gonna. F this is probably the first mission I'm gonna fail. This is probably the first mission I'm gonna fail, and that's just unfair. Um, is there patience? 
Let's have a look. Oh boy. He's not one of the patients. Oh, this is so st stupid. This is dumb. Okay, well, I need this. All right, let's eat that chocolate. Choco Tastic. Right. Did he say the main hall or the west hall? I think he's wandering on the halls. Uh, you find our super trooper yet? And what's with his hat? I don't know, mate. I, I, I'm trying to find him. He's, you seem to know where he is. <laughs> Can you let me on it then? I mean, <laughs> what is this? Maybe I should have paid attention. Maybe maybe it's me. Maybe I didn't pay attention at all. What's with his hat? Where is this guy? He's stuck in a wall somewhere, I know it. He's stuck in like some stupid room. He's probably in the ladies' bathroom. Or something. Is that him? You got these free security guards! Not doing anything. It's like, you know, where is this? Somebody, you know. <laughs> what, they got like, they were told to stand down by Dr. Pratt? Uh, stand down. Well, there's something you don't see every day a robot loose in the halls. Better call security before somebody gets hurt. Is this the guy? And apparently, someone else is loose in the hall. Sorry, what was that? A robot? <laughs> this... He doesn't look like a... He doesn't look like a space marine. He looks like a... He looks like one of the truth commissions from 1998. If you get that reference. Welcome. <laughs> oh, boy. Well... These guys are doing impressions of a robot. Yeah, this is the walking around episode. You remember that episode of ER where the doctor was just walking around looking for robots and people in military outfits? <laughs> the guy looks like he's a... That guy looked like he was about to... Uh... I don't know. Something. Like I said, betrayal of uh, people who attend comic book conventions... Not the greatest. <laughs> oh, where is the robot? Okay. Ooh, wow, that is terrifying. Daisy, Daisy. I oh. said call security, not electrocute him. See what you can do. I'll check if we have a bed open. Electrocute him? Uh, this is not going well, because now the game's glitched. No, it hasn't. <laughs> By the way, that was a 2001 reference for all you people that haven't seen that movie. Okay, I have never seen it the entire way through, but neither has anyone else. <laughs> I'm joking, of course. Well, of course we've seen it. Not that I've seen it all the way through. I haven't. It's it's a long it's a long commitment, you know. I'm not a, I'm not a hardcore science fiction fan, so you know. I tried to watch the first Star Trek ones, and it was just you know nothing happened in it, and it was just sort of like, am I dumb because I I just don't want to spend the time. Anyway, existential crisis later. Treating robot now. Standard orbit. You are have problems. Ah, bet faster, stronger. I, 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 I heard of that before. That's the six million dollar man, the bionic woman. Okay, so I'm still supposed to be keeping villains and so separated. Okay, is that? Oh, oh, hello. 
Do you have something for me? Take this, you'll find it useful more than spare parts. I'm also thinking of a Korean voice acting. Yeah, chocolate from Robot. Robot chocolate. Meet me at the nurse's station. You gotta see this. Oh boy. What's going on? What's up? I think he was waiting for me. I'm glad I found you. This gypsy's short of breath. O2 pull socks and figure out what's going on. Alright. Could have done it yourself. A lot of general surgeries today. I didn't even need to look for these guys. I'd like. Ten already. Esmeralda Romani. Huh. Can't talk now. Okay. Uh, she's slowly, slowly getting there. Huh. It's gone six o'clock. It's not even halfway through. Alright, let's do this. I need a nurse. Stat. Oh man. Now I have to talk to that nurse. Too. Which is pretty easy. Oh boy. A couple of masked marvels are heading towards the gym. Let's cut them off at the pass before they get themselves lost. Or worse. Wow, there's a lot of, um, can't actually move. There's a lot of scripted events today. This is, this is what I was talking about for the other episodes. The other episodes felt a bit light by comparison, but I'm guessing if I was thinking about- Do you hear something? Oh, what's, what's going on? Uh, the gym's this way. Yeah, give me back control. <laughs> you know, the epic tone of this music is kind of lost when you're just like, just strolling. What happened? Move these people to the ER now, then get down there and help us out. Did Miley Cyrus come through here? We meet again, good doctor. No way, dude. Quick, to the ER! I'm carry people, man. 